our solar system. Earth is only one of the eight planets that orbit our sun. All of the planets in order from closest to the sun to the farthest is Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and lastly, Neptune. Out of these, Earth is the third planet away from the sun. The four inner planets are called terrestrial planets because of their rocky terrain and heavily composed materials, while the outer four planets are known as the gas giants because they are mainly composed of gas. The closer planets are to the sun, the hotter they are, while the farther away, the colder. The sun is a star. It is the center of the solar system and which the planets revolve around. Besides the eight planets and the sun, our solar system is composed of other objects such as dwarf planets, comets, asteroids, dust and ice particles, and many more. A dwarf planet is a small planet, which does not have the three requirements needed to be considered a planet. Some of these dwarf planets include Ceres, Eris, Pluto, Makemake, and many more. Although these planets are in orbit around the Sun, and they are in the shape of a planet, they are not big enough to have enough gravitational force to be able to clear their orbital path around the Sun. Thus, its path might be bumpy and the planets may encounter large pieces of rocks while orbiting. All of these objects together form our Sun's cosmic family. They are held together by the Sun's gravitational force, which is what keeps us in place. Or else, Earth and the other planets will be flying off into the universe. Dust and ice particles are often found orbiting large gas planets, such as Saturn. Because the outer four planets are huge, they have more mass, which means they have more gravity. So, small rocks and ice are pulled in by the planet's gravitational force, which is why some planets have rings. Our solar system is not the only one that exists. There are thousands of star systems that we can't see because they are far, far away. The closest solar system to ours is the Alpha Centauri system. All in all, everything that stretches from the far side of our sun to the edge of Neptune is considered to be part of our solar system. Thank you.